Hi, folks. We're happy to have you join us here for the World Series of Bowling Scorpion Qualifier here in Las Vegas. I'm Rob Stone, and I'll be covering all the action here along with the Hall of Famer, Randy Peterson. As a competitor, what are you thinking about going into tonight? Sometimes in qualifiers, it's all about adjustments. You might have to change your strategy or switch balls if it's not working for you. Randy with the nice analysis. Let's see what happens tonight starting right now. Oh, ringer on that seven. Ninety-three percent conversion rate on the seven. That's your tour average. Easy conversion here in the first frame. Take a look at the ten pin party in the pit. Looking for two in a row. Two strikes in a row. Looking to keep it going with the triple. The strike train rolls on. Trying to keep this strike streak alive. Going for the hambo. Got the hambo. Great release on that one. Very nice. Working off the ham bone. Will we see five in a row? I wouldn't bet against it. Oh my goodness, that looked like a fantastic shot. Yeah, I mean, that was so good, really good. Everything about that was good, except the result. 93% conversion rate on the seven pin. Gets the spare here. High that time. Got it. Got it inside just a little bit and it went high. Easy conversion there. Right at it. Punches 10 back into the pit. Ryan for the double now.
now at two strikes in a row. Will we see three? We just might. And the string keeps going. Makes a nice shot there for a turkey. Looking for the ham bone here. Four strikes in a row. things up for us folks we appreciate you joining us Hi, folks. We're happy to have you join us here for the World Series of Bowling Scorpion Qualifier here in Las Vegas. I'm Rob Stone. This is my partner, the Hall of Famer, Randy Peterson. Folks have been looking forward to this one for a long time. Randy, what's the winning formula for these competitors? My strategy was always trying to start fast in qualifying events, get a jump on the competition, and then put the pressure on them. Get on them and stay on them. All right, we're all set for the second game of this qualifier. Let's get to it. How you start. Trying to get a streak going here. Got a ringing 10 out of that. The 10 pin gets converted 95% of the time. Got the spare. That shot could not have been better. Looking to get on a streak now, hunting two in a row. And there's the double. Two strikes in a row. Will we see three? We just might. There's the turkey. Good looking shot right there. Going for the ham bone now, Randy. Looking really good here. Nice streak going. Come on, 10 pin. Ninety five percent is your tour average for the 10 pin. No problem on that one. Shot there at the end. Looking for the double.
looking for three in a row now. That's a vicious ringing ten. You see how often the 10 pin is converted 95% of the time. No problem. That got down the lane in a hurry. It was a full rack attack once the ball got to the pins. Looking to keep it going here with two in a row. Already with the double, looking for a triple. Someone is heating up. Strikes again. Feeling it now. That's the end of our broadcast, bowling fans, and what a night it was. We'll see you next time. Hi folks, we're happy to have you join us here for the World Series of Bowling Scorpion Qualifier here in Las Vegas. I'm Rob Stone. This is my partner, the Hall of Famer, Randy Peterson. Tell us a little bit about the mindset these competitors have going into tonight. Consistency is what you're looking for here. I mean, you don't have to be on top after every round. You just need one of those top spots at the end to reach the finals. Game three of this qualifying tournament is ready to begin. Opens with the strike. Yeah, nice delivery on that one. Looking for two in a row. Two strikes in a row. Looking for another strike now to get that turn. Oh, just sailing along right now. Looking for the ham bone now. I mean, it's starting to get hot in here. Looking for a five bagger now. That's a vicious ringing ten. The ten pin gets converted ninety five percent of the time. the spare.
That ball went through the pins with bad intentions. Trying for the double now. Going with the triple. There's another strike. Working off a turkey, trying to upgrade to a ham bone. The question now is, can you maintain this pace and intensity? Going for the five back. And there's another strike. The strike train keeps getting longer. The strike streak is at five right now. This is what it looks like when you have the hot hand. Perfection. Brings down the hammer again, another strike. Looking to keep the streak going here. Goes a little high with that one. That brings us to the end of another night of outstanding competition. We'd like to thank our viewers for tuning in.